Hello everyone and welcome back to EAFC 24. Today is the day that we knock out the hardest SBCs in the foundation section, League and Nation Hybrids. It's a big reward at the end, we get a rare mega pack plus packs for all the individual SBCs as well. So without further ado, let's go for it. Now these are a lot harder, um, it's going to be difficult for me to tell you exactly how to do it. So I'm going to show you the team that I'm using and explain how I've got to where I've got and why I'm using the team. And then either you can copy my team exactly if you're struggling, or you can use the rough idea of what I followed to create it yourself with the players you currently have in the squad. So first of all, let's start from the hardest one, because that way we know we've got the most players available to us. Now this is the squad that I put together. Uh, we've got Adan in goal, Azpilicueta, Igor, Mario Hermoso, Trincao, Adam Lalana, Curtis Jones, Galeno, Martins, William Jose, and Sugita. Now this squad is good enough to complete. Now I'll show you roughly what I did. Now it's all about trying to link up League and Nations, um, trying to think about where you're going to go next rather than just focusing hyperly on what you're currently on. So what I did first was I picked a Spanish goalkeeper in the Portuguese league and then from that I was able to add a perfect link of Aspilicueta and Mario Hermosa which got them all full chemistry straight off the bat which was fantastic. I then added a couple of other Portuguese league players in Trincao and Galeno that was to help get Adan onto full chemistry and those two have got two out of three chemistry which is enough as well. Then with the Brazilian link of Galeno, I then added William Jose because he was Brazilian, so he linked with the Portuguese uh, player, well, a Portuguese league player, Galeno, but he's also Spanish league, so he linked up with the perfect link we have in defense to get extra chemistry. And then from that, I realized we had two Brazilians already, so I picked a Brazilian in the Premiership in Igor, uh, who was from Brighton, so I picked a strong link in Adam Lalana, uh, who is also from Brighton in English, and then a Another strong link, which is the Premiership and English route of Curtis Jones to get the extra chemistry. And then with those players in the squad alone, I had enough chemistry to complete this. But all I had the issue with was my overall rating wasn't high enough. So I picked two higher rated wingers, neither of which need chemistry at this point. Um, so you can put anybody in any position really in these positions, just as long as the rating is high enough to get us above the 80, which is exactly what we did. So hopefully that's helpful. I mean, it's all about now. It's about thinking about not just how to get the chemistry between the two players, but where you're going to fit a third in. Where are you going to be able to move into another league? So like I said, having the Spanish player in the Portuguese league, I know that I can work in the Portuguese league and the Spanish league and bring them together using this guy as a central pin. And then knowing that we've got the Spanish league in Brazil, I can then look to move into the Portuguese league with the... Uh, another Brazilian again the the link holding the two together or moving into the Premiership with a Brazilian player and then we can use that Brazilian player to link up to other Premiership players to create more chemistry so that's the idea you're sort of getting towards now it's sort of the idea of how to create your teams how to get the chemistry you need uh, but yeah if you just want to copy my team again it's Adan, Azpilicueta, Igor, Mari Hermoso, Trincao, Adam Lalana, Curtis Jones, Galeno, Martins who might be the most expensive one in there uh, William Jose and Sugita. Right, so we can complete that one. Rare players pack incoming. Again, might not be the cheapest one to complete, but you're cashing all these players in for a rare players pack, which is guaranteed 12 players. Guaranteed one of them is an 83 rated. All of them are rare. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be pretty good. Right. Now we move on to the next one. Next up then we have the Fiendish 5. We need to exchange a squad with 5 nations and 4 leagues. Again, not easy to do, but we can squeeze by. Uh, we needed exactly 4 leagues, 5 nations, no more than 4 players from the same league, no more than 3 players from the same nation, an overall rating of 80 and a chemistry of 25. I think this was harder than the previous one, to be honest with you. Um, so the way I've done it is we have, again, tried to utilize so many strong and perfect links. Of course, perfect link is when your players are from the same nation, league, and team, and strong links are when they're from two of those three. So uh, I'll take you through the team first in case you just want to copy it, that is. Uh, in goal, we got Unai Simon. Uh, we needed a couple of higher rate of players to get the rating up to the 80. On the left back, we got Spinozola, Gatti, uh, Yure, and Disciglio. We've got Blas, Kramer, Arnold, and Kramerich. 
and then up front, Sunset and Gyori. Now, what I've done here is I've looked at where we did have perfect links. There seems to be a lot in the Spanish League, so I took advantage of Unai Simon, Uray, and Sanset all playing for the same club, all being Spanish. So all three of those people get full chemistry by just the three of them being there, which was the best way I could do it. Same down here when we had Descigliu and Gatti, both, of course, being same league, nation, and club, which means they got... Uh, two out of the three chemistry points, we added an extra Italian who made that into three out of three. Uh, of course, Spinozola now only gets two. I used the perfect link up here on the left with the French League. We got Guri and Blas. Uh, again, playing the same country, same league, same team. So them two get two chemistry points each. And then in the middle, we had left Kramer, Arnold and Kramaric. Uh, we needed two players from the same league and nation. And then we added Kramerich in there as well to get the fourth and final nation we needed. So again, it's just really focusing down on the, the strong links and the perfect links where you can. Again, you can just copy my team, but if you do have the players in your squad, I think the German league will have a lot of um, perfect and strong links. The Spanish league has a lot of perfect and strong links and the Italian and the French, to be honest with you. The Premiership is a bit more difficult because there are a lot of different nations. However, there probably will be a few in there you could use, as we used in the fourth one when we had um, Lalana and Curtis Jones and players like that. But this is how I've done it. I'm one chemistry over, but I'm not going to worry about that. Again, we had to use a couple of higher rated players just to get the rating up to an 80. But again, the rewards are definitely worth it. So there we go. Submit and get ourselves a nice big prime gold players pack. Uh, which we will open at the end of the video, as always. Right, let's head back and do the next one. Right then, next up, as we continue working backwards, is advanced. And this one, we need four nations and three leagues. It's getting a bit more tricky now, to be honest with you. Uh, right, so here we go. This is the team that I've got. I'll go for it quickly first. We've got Guata, uh, Yuri Bercelli, is, yeah, whatever that is. Um, we have got Unai Nunes, Emre Chan. Lazarazi, Carlos Perez, or Charles Perez, Ravella, Amiri, Kamada, Gusens, and Mukoko. Now, the idea behind this again is strong and perfect links wherever you can. So, as you can see, we've got um, triple perfect links here of Guata, Unai Nunes, and Perez. All three of them are Spanish from the same league, from the same team. We've also gone for a perfect link of Lazarazi and Ravella with the strong link of Kamada to get the extra nation in. We went for the strong link here of Yuri Bercielli, whatever his name is, um, because he is again Spanish and plays in La Liga. And then from there in, we just filled it out with Bundesliga players. We've got Gusens to bring in a German route with Amiri, Makoko, and Emre Chan as well. And we made Chan and Makoko the same team as well to make sure we got that extra perfect link. Again, there's many ways you can complete this, but this is what I had in my squad already without me having to pay for any players. So again, it's all about searching for your team for those strong and perfect links. I mean, these uh, three guys of Gaeta, Nunes, and Perez have got us nine of the 29 chemistry we needed straight off the bat as well. Uh, and then when you look into the perfect links here of Makoko and Chan and Lazari, and Ravella, again, all perfect links because it's the only way to get enough chemistry with the small amount of players you're putting in because you get one chemistry point for the league, one for the nation, one for the team. So if you can match up two players, you're laughing, really. So that's what we've done here to complete this one. We get ourselves a mega pack. That's a great reward once again. And then we move on to the fourth and final, or technically the fourth and first, SPC, the Challenger. Right then, the challenger. So for this one, we needed three leagues, two nations, maximum from one, league six, maximum from one, nation six, all gold, chemistry of 32, with a stat perfectly, with a nice cheap team as well. So what I've done is I've gone down two nations in two leagues. So we've got on the right-hand side, we have got all English premierships. So we've got Tarkovsky, Shalaber, Harrison, Phillips, and Welbeck. And on the other side, we've got Sergio Hermoso, Lenormand, Alex Moreno, Alberto Moreno, and Zuba Mendy. And then I've also added an extra player who is in a different league from one of the nations. So Abel Ruiz plays in the Portuguese league. 
but he shares a nation with five of the players, hence why he gets two chemistry points. So again, you could do this for anybody. It doesn't need to be the same players I've picked. As long as they're all gold, um, you should be absolutely fine. But really, if you just split your team in half, uh, half of it from one nation, half of it from the other nation, and then just of the nation you've got the most. Um, so we've got six Spaniards. One of the Spaniards can be from a different league. Or, for example, if you use Italians, you'd have five Italians from Serie A and one Italian from the Premiership. Or you'd have, I don't know, four Portuguese from Liga Nos and one Portuguese from the Premiership. It, as long as you've got a five of one nation, one league, and a five of one nation, one league, and then one of either of those nations from a different league, you should be able to absolutely ace this one pretty easily. So there we go. That is the fourth and final one completed. We're going to get ourselves a rare Electrum Players Pack. We got ourselves that rare Electrum Players Pack, and we complete the League and Nation Hybrids which gives us a rare mega pack as a reward as well. So hopefully we're going to get some good rewards on these. That was the end of the foundation. So let's check what our rewards are going to be. Uh, what do we got? Let's do the um, the Prime Electrum Players Pack first, because that should be, in theory, the lowest of the rewards. A French centre-back from PSG. is 84 rated Hernandez. That's a pretty good card. I will take that all day long. That's a very good card. Anything else good in there? We've got Jakobsen as well. That's not a bad pack at all, to be honest with you. Not a bad pack at all. We've got a duplicate Mendy, who I think is untradeable. He is indeed, so he will have to be smushed. So, good start. A very good start. We've got a rare... Oh, God, we've got some good stuff here. I think this is actually in the best order here, isn't it? We're guaranteed an 82-plus rare here. It's going to be... It's Reese James, isn't it? I've already got a Reese James. Is my Reese James tradable? That is the question. Because that's a good card. Anything else good in the pack? We've got Marco Asensio, who we've used in a... Oh! We've got bloody promo. We've got Hernandez. We've got Fernandez even. We've got one of the promo cards. Why didn't that come up as the main... Oh, because it's the lowest. It's not as high rated, I suppose, is it? But um, still, yes, that is tradable. So um, you, my friend, can go straight on the transfer list. But yeah, we packed one of the promo cards. So that, I mean, he is worth... Alone, he's worth 45k, something like that. That's a good reward. That is a very good reward indeed. So we'll definitely take him into the club. Quick sell you. There we go. Already looking good. These rewards are looking good. Right, so we're going to go with a mega pack first. We're going to get an American goalkeeper. There's many of them around from Houston Dash. Might be one I've already got. I've got a few of these female American keepers now. Campbell. 84 rated. She makes good soup, apparently. Campbell soup. It's not one that I currently have. We've also got Alvaro Morata, Inglesias as well. We've got some good stuff in this one. Sniper, that's lovely. Got a duplicate Insigne. Oh, there's a new button out there. You press square and it does them all for you. So we can now actually make coins a lot easier. There we go, 1,300 coins. Again, not bad rewards. And we've still got the two biggest packs to open. So first of all, we've got a... Let's do the rare mega plaque first. It's a German cam. It's Muller, isn't it? I bet it is. It's Muller. Or is it one of the women? It is. It's my girl. That's my girl. It's pretty good. 87 rated. You can't go wrong with that card, can you? Pretty damn solid. We've got a pretty strong German team uh, building here on the women's side as well. We've got Ericsson as well. Romagnoli. Again, some good players. Locatelli. We've got three duplicates then. All of which are untradeable anyway. Oh, there was a couple of coins there. And then finally, the big one. We've got 12 players, all rare, all gold, plus 183 plus guaranteed. Will it be something big? It's Brazilian. It's a CDM. It's Casemiro, isn't it? Is it tradable? My one, I don't know if my one's tradable or not. It'd be nice to be able to get some dough out of it at least, but uh, we'll see how things go. We've also got a Kirby, Schmidt. Okay, again, some good players. Ah, oh, it's untradeable. Bugger. Casemiro's untradeable, okay. I'll see if I can do something with him anyway. But there we go. 
League and Nation hybrids are done. Hopefully that's been useful for somebody. Of course, if it has been, make sure you hit the like and subscribe and all the other good stuff. And I will see you again soon with some more videos. We'll do a video on the foundations and how that works. Not the foundations. The evolutions and how they work as well. So make sure to check that one out. As well as all the other SBCs if you've not done them yet as well. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate everyone. Please do hit the like and subscribe. All the other good stuff. And I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.